This is a tutorial how to escalate or extend a lease. We click on leases. You then choose the lease that you actually want to escalate or extend. Under active, we click extend. It automatically has the action date, which is in the 1st of January 2019. The lease type is a fixed term lease. We enter the new rental amount in. It automatically has the new lease end date. If the lease end date is different on your lease agreement, you can then change that. Enter the new deposit required amount. Then, if you are billing the owner a placement or procurement fee on lease escalation, you enter it in here. And then also enter your monthly management fee built to the owner. Save changes. Once we've done that, we need to then invoice the difference of the deposit, which is 500. So you click on the deposit held amount. Click on the future charges tab. Add a future charge. Then we need to choose the charge type, which will be a deposit top-up charge. You click on the date and enter the date of the lease escalation, which is 2019, the 1st of January. Under description, we can say deposit top-up. Lease renewal. The reference number is the same reference the tenant uses when he pays his rent. Put in the amount of 500. Save changes. And that is how you escalate or extend the lease. Thank you for watching this video.